Hey guys, welcome to Makeup by Molly. Sorry if my eyes are red, my eyes are stained from eyeshadow and also I have allergies. <laughs> Not diving. So I do have a main channel, which is just Molly J. Also, I don't even know what I'm doing with the camera here, whatever. So I do have a main channel called Molly J. You guys, English. You guys can subscribe down below if you guys want. I make funny vlogs, skin videos on there. If you're coming from that channel, hello, nice to meet you. This is my side channel where I'm going to do like makeup videos and hauls and more girly videos <laughs> because I also want to do that, but like I also love making other videos, so I thought I'd make two channels for that, you know? Alrighty, so I thought, also don't forget to follow me on Instagram at mollyjacobs58, that'll also be down below. Follow my Snapchat at mjacobs589. So yeah, let's just get started. So first, this is what my desk looks like. Don't ask me where my desk is from because I don't know because I got it for Christmas this year. So I don't really know, but yeah. So over here, I have all my makeup brushes. So I've got my face brushes. So I've got like a Firma 102 for my Ipsy, some Nicole Miller ones. Um, these marble ones, e.l.f., Color Institute, IT Cosmetics more of these marble ones um more nicole miller this blue ombre brush i found in my under my bed one day <laughs> an elf one max studio um i have another one that i really like oh um a farah 35e all of the types of brushes which this is in a mason jar this is in a wide mouth mason jar with some beads on it then I have my eye brushes, which just have um, Luxie 243 Precision Blending Brush, Elf, SL Miss Glam, Color Institute, Elf, Marble Brush, um, Nicole Miller, Concealer Brush from Target, <laughs> but I use a Zashner Brush, Cargo Cosmetics, more Color Institute, Scully, uh, different just types of eye brushes. I have 13 in total. I have 13 eye brushes, and I think like. 20 something face brushes. I just squeeze them all in here. Um, a smudge brush, um, an eyebrow brush, even though I don't even do my eyebrows. I use it for eyeshadow. <laughs> all different types of brushes. Then over here, I've got my mirror that I use all the time. Say hello. <laughs> oh, yes, double tin chin me love. Got that, which there used to be a light on it, but I don't have batteries in it, so sorry about that. Then I have this little jar, which holds all of my beauty sponges. So I've got this one, this black one from Wish, this marble one from Real Techniques that is from TJ Maxx, um, another one from Wish, this one I'm currently using, uh, the black one I'm currently using from Wish, so yeah, um, these two silicone ones, which is by Revell, and then this Bare Minerals foundation brush. I don't really use the silicone one or the brush, but whatever, whatever. And those just chill out. Then I have a my beauty. Then I have the my beauty spot clarify cucumber vitamin A and witch hazel hydrating face mist, which you can use for moisture like hydration mist, or you can use it after you do your makeup. Which I just got this today, like literally like an hour ago, and I'm really excited. It's a very fine mist. If you can see that it's just a very fine mist and it gets like all of your face in one spray so this is really easy to use and it's just really hydrating and it makes like a dewy look then i have my studio five-year trophy because every five years in my studio you get one and a solar powered duck thing which is from a flea market like how cute whenever the sun hits it it's so cute oh my god i love it also ignore my ugly, ugly curtains we're redoing my room so we are like trying to figure out like the theme that i'm going for which i'm going for black white and gold so that's why like my room has like cringy black and white stuff right now it's because and that's why my room also looks so bare it's because we just have to we're paying soon so that's why Then in this tiny little drawer over here, we have some stuff. No way. So in this first drawer, I have like all of my base makeup. So in this little back container here, I've got like all high, all blushes and bronzers. So I've got this Tarte one in the shade Part Party, which is the Amazonian clay one. 
I know Ashlyn Duvall raved about this at one point, and she still does, and I got it, so I'm really happy about it. This is Max Studio one, which is just a warm tone one, which is my summer shade. Then I have this cool tone one, which is my winter shade. These both are my winter shade. This one's if more of a natural look, like for school, and this one's just for like the weekends and just for just regular looks. Then I have all my bronzers, so I've got this one, which is my summer shade. This contour tree, which is also my summer shades and blushes, contours, and highlights. This one's more like gold. Then this is for darker skin tones in case I do other anyone's makeup, but I love this highlight. I hit pan on it. It's so icy and pretty, and this blush is really pretty too, but the contour is for darker skin tones. I also just rub my finger in that. And then I just have this LA Eden London highlight in the shade Julia. This is actually a eyeshadow. It's supposed to be an eyeshadow, but I prefer it as a um, highlight. So that's all that goes in there. Just all of my like summer shade stuff mostly. Um, I do have a lot of summer shade stuff. I need to get more winter shade stuff because winter is mostly year round here because I live in New England. So anyway. That was part of the organizer. I got this organizer from a dollar store, and then inside this white one, which the blue one's inside the white one is a weird thing, I have my other highlights. So I've got the Lottie London Shimmer Squad highlight in the shade The Good Girl. Um, I got this in an Ipsy. It's super pretty. It's like a champagne pink. Then I have the Siete London Glow 2 highlighter in the shade Moon Dust. I also got this in my Ipsy. I get Ipsy's every month. My mom signed me up for it for Christmas, actually. And I've been loving them ever since then. This one is one of my favorite highlights ever. So, it's such a pretty shade. Like, ugh, this one will be really good for summer. Then over here, I've got concealers. I have the e.l.f. 16-hour camo concealer in the shade Light Peach. The Koki Professional slash Koki Cosmetics one in the shade Light. This is their illuminating one from my Ipsy. The e.l.f. one is from Target. Then I have the It Bye Bye Red Bye Bye Under Eye Full Coverage Anti Aging Waterproof Concealer, which is in the shade 13.0 in that light natural, which I got in my Ipsy yesterday, but it's too dark for me, so I'm giving it to my mom actually. But I just wanted to include it in this video since I have it for the time being. Then in this little organizer from the dollar store as well, I have all my setting powders. So I've got the Bare Minerals Mineral Veil and this pressed powder, which is actually really good. I forget what brand it's by because it rubbed off, but it's really good and it's really. I love this one. It's really pigmented and it sets the face so nicely. I forget where I got this, but it's really good. I need to get another one. I need to find where that's from. If you guys recognize the packaging, please let me know. <laughs> now let's move over here. Hello? Can you pause? I mean, no, but I could just edit it out. Mm. Um, sure. I don't like the shirt, the ruffles, but it's still cute. <laughs> I do, so. Yeah. But I'm saying, does it look alright, like, matching-wise? Yeah, it looks yeah. good. Alright. No comment. Okay, so moving on to the middle. What? <laughs> no comment. Okay. Back to this part, in here I just have like awards that I've won, like at school, pictures from dance that I need to keep to give to people still from like last year, and all that stuff. Then I've got a pair of glasses that I don't wear because they're ugly, my brush cleaner by Sigma, and some random things. I've got like a game card for my Nintendo Switch, fake AirPods that me and my friends made, coins, and a broken bobby pin, and then a love pearl that I got from Florida. And there's actually a mirror. Time for this drawer. So, ignore the foot bath over here. I got this for Christmas and it's literally the best thing I've ever gotten. Like better than the laptop I got for Christmas, better than anything. That thing's everything. Okay, so first in this little small container here, I have all my mascaras and eyelash things. So I've got an eyelash curler that I got for Christmas. Then I have this brand D-O-U-C-C-E Punk Volumizing Mascara. This wand is crazy. I got it for my Ipsy last, last, uh, yesterday. And the wand is really a Christmas tree. Like, it's huge. I tried it out today. It's way too long. Way too thick. <laughs> got It Superhero. 
Tarte Man Eater. Those two are for my Ipsy too. Um, the East 1999 um, Ico Cosmetics Slash Alert from my Ipsy. Um, that one's from my Ipsy. And then this one I got for my mom actually. It's the Maybelline The Falsies Wine Express. She got this for me. Bare Minerals Lash Domination. I got this for Christmas. For Christmas, I actually like after Christmas, I got like this huge beauty advent calendar. And it had like a bunch of like eyelash, it had like an eyelash curler in there, mascaras, skincare stuff that I already use, face masks, Mally Volumizing Mascara in the shape black. And then I have the e.l.f. clear eyelash and brow gel, but I just use it for my eyebrows. That's all of my mascaras and stuff. I love mascara because, one, I already have long eyelashes, so it just makes them look so, like, like, pump, like, so, like, nice and clean. I just love mascara. Back here, I kind of just have some random stuff, so I've got, like, a CoverGirl eyebrow palette that I don't even use. I used the highlight at one point. Because the highlight was like super blinding to me at one point, even though I have way better highlights now. And then that I dropped. <laughs> Those I dropped and that broke. But like, haven't used this otherwise. I got it for I got it around summertime actually. I have four of these pencils that are for like waterline and stuff like that. In, by Max Studio. Four of their liquid liners from Max Studio. I got black, brown, blue, and silver. Then I have a Revlon little color stay Exactify one, which has the little pinwheel on it, which is just in black. Then I've got a brow pencil from Jordana in the shade dark brown. I just found it in my room one day. And then three spoolies in case like a friend comes over and they want to do their makeup, I can just have them use my mascaras, but without trying them. So I don't get pink eyes or another dry eye. This is the stuff I use more often though. And that's that drawer. Now let's come over to my favorite, my least favorite part over here. <laughs> so under here, I just have a wet brush, my Ipsy cards that I get whenever I get my Ipsy's every month. And then I have this makeup bag from Primark and it just has all my hair accessories in it because one, I go to school and I have to put my hair up sometimes for the gym and stuff like that. And also I take ballet and jazz, so I need to put my hair up. First in this drawer, and it's nicely organized. I also hate the blue organizers, too. They didn't have any white ones, so don't judge me. <laughs> I have the makeup eraser sample, which I'm going to get a full size of this for sure. It's really good. Then I have my makeup wipes from Bolero. A face oil by Josie Moran. Some Japanese cherry blossom perfume that I use every day. My secret um, deodorant that I use every day. This cucumber melon stuff that I... Hand sanitizer that I use every day. Um, then I have this 1-1 one -one skin... Um, serum that's like repair serum for your face and neck. I tried it out today. I got it on my Ipsy. It's really good. So I'm gonna start using that. And then I have my favorite tweezers for them for my eyebrows so I don't have a unibrow or anything. Those are from TJ Maxx actually. Then back here I've got stuff that I don't use that often. So I've got like Revlon tweezers that are like really exact. Uh, a Haba hydration cream mask. Um, that. Oh. I, I have a hydration cream mask, this bug thing that repels mosquitoes. I actually have never used this, even though I've had it for two years. I've only opened up the seal and never actually opened it, or else it takes away the hours that it lasts, so I haven't actually used this. Some batteries for my mirror <laughs> that I need to put in. This Clinique Take the Day Off Balm that I got on my Ipsy. I actually really like this. I only have a little bit of this left, like half of it, so yeah. Ultra Repair Cream for my hands, because they get crusty sometimes. Japanese Cherry Blossom Lotion. And Vanilla B. Noel hand sanitizer. I can only use Christmas themed products in Christmas. I don't know if that's just me, but I can only do it then. <laughs> then I have all of my lip products. So, oops, I just hit the tripod. I've got all like my favorites, glosses, and then I've got liquid lipsticks and lipsticks. Then I've got like all of my eyeshadow things. So in this little organizer, I have my individual eyeshadows. So I've got this Nomad Champagne Reef one which the packaging for this, so cute, and it's cruelty free, and um, it's vegan, not that that matters to me personally, but it's so pretty, it's just a gold eyeshadow that I got my Ipsy, so pretty, so good, and fresh, <laughs> this is the Balm Cosmetics one in the shade Bootylicious, love that shade name, these shadow sticks, um, some other palettes, so I've got this Mystic one, this sculpt one that actually just hit pan on the bronzer. <laughs> this nude one. 
rose gold one. My feet are falling asleep. Um, the smoky one. Actually, I've never used this palette, just only swatched it. Those are all of my box palettes from Christmas that I got from my mom. I mean, my Nana. Those box palettes I got from my Nana actually for Christmas. Then I have the Nicole Miller New York State Golden Eyeshadow Palette, which is just all shimmers. I got this yesterday. And this is just good to have shimmers because um, I've been complaining to myself about like not having enough shimmers. Like, obviously, I have a lot, but, like, I don't have enough to where I can just, like, use one on, like, the inner part of my eye. So, I just got some wide variety ones. I've got, like, burgundy, orange, gold, bronzy golds, pinks, champagne colors, nude colors, um, like, a gray one. All different ones. Then I have the Ellen Tracy Crown Jewels um, Precious Meta Metals eyeshadow palette. Love all these shades. The packaging, like, the colors remind me of the Kylie Jenner, like like 21st birthday palette I think it was or like her 18th birthday palette I don't really know but it's really pretty I love the colors and then I've got the Cargo Cosmetics sorry I keep on hanging the about the Cargo Cosmetics Wanderlust palette I love this palette I actually only really use these two shades because they're the most <sighs> my favorite eyeshadows ever at the moment they're just so pretty you probably can't even see them on camera because there's no lighting down here then I've got the Profusion Eyes Pro Shadow Eyeshadow Case in Smoky. This is my first ever eyeshadow palette from like four months ago. Um, but it's really pretty. It has like whites to like blacks. It's a perfect smoky palette, but I use this one still quite often. I haven't used it in like a month though. Because I've been trying to veer away from it. Because <laughs> I love this palette so much. I've been trying to expand. I just like the regular basic nudes. Then I have the PS Velvet Rose Eyeshadow Palette. Um, oops, the sheet cover with all the names came off of it but i love this palette also this one's a new one of mine as well by primark it was actually only seven dollars and it's really pretty packaging and those are all of my eyeshadow things and these sterlite drawers i think are from target next time bye guys